to admit, I'm a hard working person. Good afternoon. It is now the next day. It's now the 9th, Tuesday. Um, it's pretty late in the afternoon. I had to take Jesse to Salt Lake this morning for a doctor's appointment. And then there wasn't too much going on the farm. He tried plowing a little bit more, but he said it was too wet. So now he is out here on Jonathan's that we plowed yesterday. He's got the 4455 out here and he's tromping the ground down. So what we do is we drive up and down the field and offset and then pack it. It helps set the dirt up, set the sand up, start firming up and preparing the seed bed. It also gives the seagulls some worms to eat. He's also dragging the, the really old Triple K harrow over it to seal it off to help hold the moisture in. But on this sand, we have to tromp it like this. Otherwise, we'll just lose the moisture way too fast. having some trouble with the hay roots. But. I'm glad he's doing this. I could never drive straight enough. I'd get too wide or too narrow on this guess past here. You just kind of have to guess how far to be away. But yeah, that's what we got to do to all the ground that we plow. You can see how fast this sand dries out. This was just plowed yesterday. And it's already drying out. If it was warm enough, he could probably plant here in another day or two. I think he's going to try and get the corn drill out. I think he's going to start maybe next week, depending on what the weather does. It's a little chilly right now. Well, they're talking like 70s for the weekend. I'm looking forward to that. We need it to warm up so we can start cleaning ditches. We got to get a bunch burnt. He's got to get the grain sprayed again. Get some 2,4-D sprayed on it for weeds. And I think put a little more fertilizer on, I think.
after this when he's ready to ready to plant it he'll come in and put some fertilizer down then we'll take the other tractor and the harrow over it work that in but, all right i'm gonna go check on ethan i think he's on the trampoline and then i gotta start getting ready for bed i gotta work tomorrow three o'clock in the morning comes really early so we'll call that a night <laughs> 